What's up, guys? Welcome to workout number seven of the Tabata series. Quick reminder, 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. We're going to go through eight different movements. You're going to cycle through it four times. You'll have a minute in between each cycle to catch your breath and grab a drink. Before you get started, click right here to get warmed up. At the same time, don't forget to subscribe so that you don't miss out on any of the future workouts. All right, today we're going to get our heart rate up. We're going to push ourselves 20 minutes, hard work. Let's get this show on the road. First thing we're going to do is split hops. Hands are going to go on the hips. We're going to hop up and back. Now, if you want, you can always just do a standard reverse lunge. So you're standing up. You can go nice and quick, dropping the back knee. If not, you're with me. We're doing that full split lunge. Good. All the way to the end. And done. Well done. Okay, we got our butts. We're going to do the Russian twist. So I'm going to demonstrate here from the side. Sit up tall. Your heels are gonna be on the ground. You can go side to side, or you can lift up with those heels or the feet, and you're gonna tap and go. Nice controlled taps. It's not too much of a rotation. We're just gonna work those obliques. Good, well done. We got plank rows. So you're gonna be in a push-up plank position. Shoulders directly above the wrists. Core is nice and tight. Squeeze the butt, squeeze the abs. And we're gonna row. So you're gonna lift the arm up. This is a great move if you have dumbbells. You can hold on to the dumbbells as you row. Make it a little bit more challenging. So good work. Keep rowing all the way to the end. Push. Good. Okay, to your feet, we have the lateral hops. So you're gonna go side to side. Pretend that there's an imaginary line. Your first option is always just kind of stepping side to side over the line, or you can do the full hop. Good work. Tap and go. Quick on your toes, soft landing. Good, catch your breath. We're gonna go elbow to opposite knee. So our right leg is gonna go up on our basically our near our quad, and our left elbow is gonna tap that knee. Lifting the shoulders off of the ground. Good work. Well done, okay. Stay on the mat, we got plank to push up. So we're gonna start out in a forearm plank position. Squeezing the butt and the abs. And we're gonna go up into a plank and then back down. And we're gonna switch hands each time. Good. Spread your feet to give you a better base to allow you to keep the hips nice and still as you go up and down. Good. Okay, back to the mat. On, on your back, we're gonna take that left knee our left leg is going to go up on the right knee quad. Your right elbow is going to touch that left knee. <laughs> Got to get the word straight so that you guys do it properly. Keep pushing. And then as soon as we're done with this, we got high knees next. Good. Getting that shoulder off the ground. Okay, last one. Hop to your feet. Now, if you have any issues with ankle, lip, or knee, you can always just do a standard march. If not, you're with me. High knees, get them up. Fast, fast, fast. Keep going, keep going, keep going. We'll grab, grab a drink right after this. Good. Whew. That's one down. Good start. Grab a quick drink, catch your breath. Got a lot of construction going on around here. So you might hear some banging, some sawing, some drilling. So if that does affect the sound quality, I do apologize. And as I mentioned previously, fire up your own music so you guys can listen to whatever it is that you want to listen to versus 
whatever I would have playing. Plus, I want you to hear me make sure that you're doing things properly. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do, back to that split hop, you can do that reverse lunge if you want to. If not, you're gonna do that hop with me, switching legs each time, getting that heart rate elevated. We got less than 10 seconds. Round number two is coming up. Three, two, one, let's go. I'm hopping. Here we go. I'm staying low, not coming all the way up, keeping that tension on those quads. The whole time you got five seconds. Three, two, one, done, well done. Okay, to our butt, we got the Russian twists. I'm gonna just demonstrate right now, with my heels on the ground. Sit up tall. We're gonna go side to side. Just a control movement. I don't want you to really over exaggerate it. Just side to side, pretend that you're holding a dumbbell or like a medicine ball. And just get a good rotation. Go at a decent pace. Good. Okay, we got the plank rows. So you're in that push-up plank position, shoulders directly above the wrists and the hands. Squeeze the butt, squeeze the abs. Keep those hips nice and still. Alternating each time. Great work. Really focuses on stabilizing whichever arm and hand are on the ground. You should feel that in your shoulders. Good work. <clears throat> Got the lateral hops going side to side. I'm gonna hop this one. You can step or hop, either option works. Just make sure you make it over the line. Push yourself on your toes. Good. Okay, we're gonna take that right leg, cross it over that left. Here we go, left elbow, right knee. Good job. You should feel that core strength. Those abs are activated. Good. Okay, on to our belly. We have the plank to push up. So we're gonna start out in that forearm plank position. And we're gonna pop up into a push up plank, back down. Pop back up, back down. Good. Back onto our backs. That left leg is gonna cross over the right. Right elbow is gonna to touch that left knee. And we're up. Once we're done with this, we're gonna finish with the high knees. Good, hop to your feet. As always, you gotta march or the full high knees. And go. Knees up. You got some birds right overhead. I'm making way too much noise this morning. And done. Good work. So it's two down, two more to go. <clears throat> Quick drink. <sighs> Already starting to plan out our next series. It's gonna be a good one. Be a little bit longer workouts, but feel free to always jump around. You can always do, you can do a workout a day if you want to. 
So start something and finish it. But this next series is gonna be a lot of fun too. We'll be going three days a week from upload standpoint, workout standpoint versus this one, which is two. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, certainly don't hesitate to leave them in the comments section. I read them all. Here we go. We got split hops or reverse lunge. Reverse lunging and then the hops. Either one works. Come on. Round number three, you and me. We got this. Good. We got the Russian twists. Up nice and high. Feet are off the ground here on this one. We're going side to side. Stay tall. Well done. Good. Okay, we got the plank rows. Plank position, here we go. And we're rowing. Control, slight pause at the top, back down. Really focus, strengthening and stabilizing the shoulder joint. Good. To our feet, we have the lateral hops. Nice athletic stance. Here we go, hopping. Staying on those toes. Soft landing, keep pushing. Well done, okay. Elbow drops the knee, right leg crossing the left. <sighs> left elbow, right knee, and we're up. Flipping over to the other side, we have the plank to push up. It's so forearm plank position. If you want to just hang out here the whole time, that's fine. If not, you're popping up with me. Back down, back up, good. Well done. Okay, back to our back. We're gonna cross that left leg over the right. Right elbow, left knee. And we're up. I actually like the 10 second rest interval. It makes you go quick. There's no time to wait around. We're moving. Good. And then we're back to high knees. Let's do it. We'll grab a drink right after this. If you got a march, that's fine. If not, stay with me. Get those knees up. Well done. Three down. We got one more to go. The word of the day today is gonna be shampoo. You clean your hair with shampoo. So leave that in the comment section. Let me know that you completed this workout successfully. And then as I mentioned earlier, leave the comments, questions, and concerns 
that you have. I read all of them, so I look forward to hearing from you. And then also tell me, if you can, how your day's going. Some of you might be doing this workout at the end of your day. Some of you might be doing this at the beginning of your day or even in the middle. So hope it's a good one. Let me know how it's going. This is our last cycle word of the day shampoo. Enough with me talking. We got split hops and we are going to do this. And go. If you get sick of me talking, just mute during the breaks. I give you permission. And done. Good. To our butt. We got the Russian twists. I don't know why it came from, or why it's named Russia. Maybe it came from Russia. Not sure. That's something for Google. Feet stay high. We're rotating. Come on. This is our last one, so let's push ourselves here. Good. We got the plank rows. And up in the plank. Here we go. And get a good row. Pause for that split second and back down. Good. To our feet. The lateral hops. Quick as you can go here. It's our last one. Either step or hopping. Good. To the mat, we got the elbow to opposite knee, right leg crossing the left, left elbow, right knee. Get the shoulders off the ground. Let's do it. Good. Plank to push up. <clears throat> Starting in that forearm plank position. And we're up. And back down. Good. And we're back to the mat. We got the left leg crossing over that right. Right elbow, left knee. Let's do it. Good pace. Breathe and push yourself. We're almost done here again, come on. Good, hop to our feet. We have the high knees and the rest of the day is yours. And we're up. Good. Well done today. Give yourself a round of applause. Once again, thank you so much for joining me for this particular workout. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any future workouts because we got one coming later this week. Have a good rest of your day. We'll see you soon.